Hello everybody, hope you're doing well. Welcome to a spending spree at the, what, collector's store of candy spending. Hope you're doing well. Um, let's get into it. So, as lot you know, there is a spreadsheet, by the way. Link is in the description. It's uh, this one. We'll go over it in a second. Uh, but I already made a video on this, like, ages ago. But we've now come to a point where it's the finishing of the event. I have 50,000 candies to my name, uh, which is there. Uh, and it's, of course, a high time... Um, for hypersonic missiles, no. Um, for those that know Sam Fender, they get that reference. Others do not. So we have got uh, all those candies to spend, and of course, where to spend them. As I did a full video on this before, you can check that out. It's somewhere on the channel uh, for this month. But I did a scenario uh, which kind of looked at a spending element of uh, getting all these things: six star signature stone crystals, getting ten of them, uh, getting six star signature stone standard. Uh, some Thronebreaker ones, Tier 3 Alpha Fragments. Uh, look, spend how you see fit. Uh, there's also Tier 5 Class Catalyst. I think there's uh, some 7 Star Hero Crystal Shards in this one. So there's lots of things on offer. And all of this here, all this lovely stuff, does come to a final figure of uh, 49,900. I also don't know why. Um, when I try and put it in the green box, which, which I was trying to do, it doesn't work for whatever reason whatever that is i don't know and to be honest it's now coming to the end of it so it is what it is i've got i've set myself out with stuff here this lovely kind of target of uh, of grabbing so i thought hey let's just kind of go over this again uh spend as you see fit and what you can get your hands on because you might be looking at the store going like well what's the best way to spend if anything and do bear in mind by spending as well oh should claim a crystal Never go without a four-hour crystal in stock. Um, you get all of this here, all this lovely stuff. So for getting a certain amount, you get a certain amount more. So let's get right into the spending spree. And if there's any remaining crystals, of course, we'll kind of like go and open them up uh, in this video. Um, just to kind of like illustrate what we're doing. I should really go with my order of what I'm doing, just so I know kind of what, I'm, what, what am I doing. Uh, and make sure I go for the correct one. So let's go with the six-star signature stones first off. Uh, then we are going to go with a the other one, which is a six star signature stone crystal, uh, which is there. Uh, so grabbing that, I have to make sure that this works because I've never I've not had an opportunity to spend, and this is of course based on a based on a 50k spend. Whereas I think it's by 41k you can get all the stuff with the milestones, which we're going to see uh, in a second. So there should be some more six star signature stones available at lower. Yes, that's Paragon. What well, higher even? Uh, the Paragon one. Uh, I need six star signature stones at the moment. And that will save me from spending uh, any of my battle chips. I should really kind of jump the gun and grab the seven star crystal shards because that's going to be important as well. Uh, I'm not grabbing any of the relic shards, although am I close? No, I'm not even going to be close with purchasing all of those. So there's also some more six star signature stones. Apparently, some there we go. There's the crystals. So that's fine. That should be. Uh, where are we up to with the spend so far? That is 37,250 left to spend, based on the fact we've uh, spent a good chunk so far. There's a six, uh, tier 6 class catalyst selector, which is there. You can get two of them. And, of course, it's best to choose where you're close to forming. And am I close to forming? Well, I'm sort of close to forming there with a the cosmic. So I think we'll go with, well, I'm not sort of close. I'm a little bit far away than I maybe like, but uh, yeah, just get some more of those Cosmics, get close to it and stuff like that. Tier 3 Alpha Fragments, that's the next way we're going with this one. Uh, I'll jump the gun and get the Tier 6 ones because I see them right there. So as I know to get them, I'm going to grab them. And then we've got to the Tier 3 Alpha, which is there. Go and grab that one. And then we've got ourselves some more. So I get the the ones there. Now, I'm sure people would... It's very debatable to say that... Is it worth getting such a small amount, so smaller volume there? Possibly. But I'll take any tier, tier 3 Alpha and Tier 6 Basic at this moment in time. Especially because... You know, it's all about getting close. It's all about building stronger champions for your battle deck. It's all about building stronger champions for content. Uh, but I think battle deck is probably the most important thing in Battlegrounds, which uh, I need to go into today, I want to say. Um, that's my plan of, plan, plan of attack when 
I think lunchtime work, I'll probably get a chance. Don't know if I get a chance in the evening. Um, it's such a difficult time to kind of find extra time between incursions and trying to hit my target with uh, Arena. By the way, 250 units up on my target, which was to end the week on 17,000 units. I'm up to 17,250. Uh, my plan is to hopefully be uh, at 7,500 by about Saturday. Uh, but we'll have to see. Hopefully it's more positive than that. In any case, moving on. I digress. Uh, tier 6 basic fragments. I think we've done all of that. Great. Right. Tier 1 celestial fragments. I am going to go for that. Again, a bit of an, uh, an odd choice, but I'm kind of forcing myself to, to do stuff with relics. So, you know, it is what it is. Uh, and then we've got to move on to 6 star shards. I'm doing this because I decided to open those crystals and it does leave me a little bit short. I'm trying to get uh, myself, I think it's a photon goes into the thing of a job um so the thing of a job the six star featured it's not thing of a job so that's the kind of plan with that one uh am i going to get this one i am going to get this one get these uh all those shards right there uh, those six star shards kind of add them into the collection ready for that uh, particular crystal opening okay we're drawing to the end now i'm getting tier five basics or am i getting tier 25 percent tier two class alloy Tough one, really, really, with that one. I'll come back to that one. Uh, as pff, look, gold wise, I think I'm running well, I'm up to 4.6 mil gold, but I kind of feel like I'm going to need more soon. Tier 5 CC, again, debatable. Like, I'm getting more tier 5 CC nowadays. I'm going to get, I'm going to get five lots of the gold side of things. In this moment of time, I should really be following my process. I want to feel like I want to, like, kind of go away from the process that I set out myself but um, I'm finding it a bit, a bit tough like to uh, to go away from it because I don't want to scupper myself uh, with any kind of like last minute changes because we set out this this program uh, to get the uh, the volume but I just need to spend 11,000 so I suppose in some cases like I'm I'm going away from it Lord have mercy on me for this one, um, but uh, I am going to be um, going to be doing it. Oh, this is this could be my undoing. I've gone very much relicy, uh, which maybe I shouldn't have done. And yeah, it's now ending into uh, maybe more spicier items and cha changing kind of positions on things like okay, tier two. Um, let's let's kind of try and form on that one. So that's another 1k spend. And this will be interesting to note, like, if you change your mind partway through, will it cause any problems with you? So this is interesting to kind of, like, test out uh, with um, uh, the sudden shift in dynamic of, uh, of grab. Now, of most relics that I want. So last minute kind of, like, changes, additions, grabs. Tier 5 Class Catalyst Selector. Now, let's do a couple of them. So that's me, 3,000 left to spend. And try and grab and fill out on uh, science, it seems. Because I'm low on science, so I get some more science. I remember when it was so difficult to get these. Now they're just, like, handed out like candy. Okay, finishing up now. Wrapping up. We've got to make some decisions. I think I'm going to grab more gold. Or, no, actually, I think I'm fine for gold. What's my gold situation at now? It's at 5.1 mil. Got to do some more incursions. Uh, and I'm sure I'll get some more gold down the line. So, I think as I've purchased a lot of the more spicier things. And I don't need any more tier 5 basics. Or do I? Uh, which I'm overstacking at the moment. And I get them more regularly. I'll probably look to something like... Let's do some relics, shall we? 3k to finish off. Um, and it gets me a relic to open. Okay. And that is a different process. But let's have a look. I went off keel. Off keelter. Or whatever it is. Um, off piste. Whatever it is. I don't know what the terminology is. Right? But look. I still managed to spend the same amount. Interesting, isn't it? So I don't think it's too much... Number one, you can't buy any everything, but even by me diverting away from my structure, which I put there, uh, you might be like, why did you? Well, it's important to find out. If you go off kilter and go, mm, hang on a minute, I, I want to go in a different direction, at least you get the answer to go, it's going to be okay. So what's further is going to be, furthers, that's not even good English, what further is going to be okay is the fact that I have now um, done all of these. Look at all that. I've grabbed all of the grabbed all of them 
that's that's a lot of rewards coming my, coming my way. But I guess that's one thing that I will point out with this is that you actually end up making more gains than you thought you would you would possibly make. So I suppose with gold side of things, more gold is in the milestones, and that's like adding to the extra kind of um, uh, spice to all of this. So hey, you got to rate it. What it also means is you can change your direction of like. Okay, well, there's obviously shards, there's tier 3 alpha, there's tier 6 basic in here. It's all adding up. So you could be like, well, I won't spend on the gold side of things, but I'll grab this. The same thing with like, well, there's some relic items in here or relic associated items. So I don't need to buy quite so many when it comes to uh, the, um, the, the spend in the store. And there we go. That has been the video. Thank you very much for watching and uh, hope your grind in games good. I will leave the link to the spreadsheet if you're interested, but I think this is a very straightforward spend and you've probably grabbed it by now. But thanks in any case for supporting and we'll see you next month or next week for a brand new quest and update. Cheers, everybody. Bye bye.